We've arrived in the next country. It is here in Tokyo, Japan. It's going to be sick. Going to start off with a POV. We might have a little bit of rain later on. We'll see how it goes. I'm walking from Sumida City to Shinjuku City um, with the 85mm f1.4 Mark II, and we're going to see what I get along the way. There's a nice leading line here, which we're going to get down. Again, just getting started. Maybe as cyclists go through. So this turns out. Just getting started. I mean, it's probably a bit of a dead photo because I didn't even check my settings, but just getting warmed up and we'll see how we go. Okay, so basically to get to where we want to go, we're heading straight down this road, but I've just seen this turn off road here, which looks really sick. It's really nice. Oh, that's really good. If I focus down the end, you can kind of see like how busy the street is. Okay, sick. So that was F1.4. 125 for a second, ISO 800. Still getting going. You've seen how long the video is. It's a nice, long, chill POV, so go and grab your snacks. Okay, so the rain gods have graced us with some rain. Uh, it wasn't supposed to rain, but there's a, obviously a flurry of umbrellas going up. So we'll try and get some shots as we're going around. Like this one down here, F1.4, 125 of a second. This dude. Sick, that dude down there walking. Maybe in landscape. Gotta love the rain. Luckily enough, it's just giving it a light little dusting of rain. So it's not super heavy. It's not getting like me drenched. And if it was gonna, oh, hello Roxanne. Yeah, hello. Hi. How are you? Are you enjoying the rain? Oh, marvellous. Oh, it's better than the UK rain. Yeah. It's Japanese rain. I know. That's the best thing about it. Okay, dude on the bike. Sick. Gonna chew through this memory card. Jeez. It's on high plus. Need to change that. Gonna change my uh, drive mode to... I think medium will be enough. I don't need it at higher plus. I'm not shooting like cars or anything like that. Okay, so I'm gonna come over to the left here with the compression of the 85 mil get down a bit maybe the dude running in will add some action to it that's pretty sick okay umbrella shot here with the compression with that 85 mil goodness we are at a thousand iso f1.4 200 of a second Nice. So situation update, it's uh, still moist. Still seems to be getting more moist because it's, uh, it's definitely not a shower. Uh, so you know, 2000 ISO, 320 of a second F1.4. See if we can capture some of those raindrops on the front of this taxi. We're currently just hiding under this while we wait for the uh, traffic signal to go. These like transparent umbrellas look really, really good. So we're 160 of a second. ISO 500 F1.4 and we're on green so let's keep moving let's keep going okay shot here F1.4 dude walking towards me gonna try and get the writing on the floor as well which is really nice wait for him to enter that light sick nice Oh, it's rainy. It's so rainy. Okay, so just going across here. Uh. Okay, so as this video is so long, I'm just going to try and shoot as much as I can. So get that guy going through the frame. The uh, the taxis here are actually pretty, like some of the old school taxis look pretty sick. Um, we're about halfway to kind of where I want to get to, but I need to start shooting some more. Uh, dude over on the left-hand side, walking through the frame. I think we'll go portrait, I'll follow him through. And as he gets to this light here, should be pretty sick. Following, following, tracking, tracking. Nice. With the edit as well, like that like kind of moody kind of feel, that kind of vibe looks really sick. Can we get a panning shot of the dude? No, because I was going too slow. 
but I tried. Just walking up here and I've got a nice little skyline view, which isn't going to be amazing with the 85. It'd be better if I had a 200 mil, but we'll do what we have. It's pretty sick. Let's see if it's in focus. And it is, yeah, it's good. We found a mandarin tree. Is it? Yeah. yeah. Really? I think so. Go get some mandarin though. I don't know if it is. Okay, another clear umbrella shot. Sick. Hopefully one of those is in focus because I didn't check my settings. Yeah, good. Sweet. Just crossing this bridge and you can see that there's a train down here. So I'm going to get a shot of some people sitting on the train. Just because uh, we've got about 45 minutes till we get to where we're going. Let's get one in landscape as well. See if we can get one as it's pulling off. So a shot of this dude going into the subway. Change the settings quickly. Sick. Okay. I mean, it's still raining consistently. Um, neither myself or Roxanne brought. Uh, Roxanne. <laughs> what is it, rucksack? I just rucksack. Neither of us brought a Roxanne. Yeah, great. Neither of us brought a coat. Or an umbrella. Gonna get a shot of this dude here waving his little baton. Very colourful. We're nearly there. We, we've got about a 25 minute walk ahead of us, but we're not far from where we want to get to. Um, but I'm getting a little bit sniffly. <laughs> I hope I don't get sick because it's the first day here, but we'll see how we go. Hopefully not. Um, there's so much to capture. I also don't want to do everything at once. I want to leave some things to do in the future. Okay, let's cross quick. Go. Taxi here. I'm gonna, I want to try and get some of the uh, the rain. So we go 320 for a second. ISO 1600. F 1.4. Because the rain's coming down quite hard now. When I checked earlier, it says no rain at all. Then it started spitting. Then it said maybe a chance of 40%. Then it said nothing. And now it's, it's proper raining. And I'm, uh, I'm only in, in a shirt and a t-shirt and some sniffles. We've got another guy here with a umbrella up ahead. I don't know if I'm going to catch him or not because he's quite far ahead. Might have to get the skates on to be able to get there. And if you don't know what I mean by skates, the Tokyo floors are very slippy, so you can skate wherever you want up in the wind and the rain. Oh my god. Okay, decided to get some running shoes on, catch up with the dude. Kind of left Roxanne behind, but she'll thank me. Oh, he's gonna stop as well. Sick. Okay, we'll get one there to be safe. Just crossing. Okay, sick. Oh, hello, you caught up. Oh, Family Mart. <laughs> We've been in so many 7-Elevens and Family Mart because they're open for 24 hours. So whenever it gets too bad, we're just like jumping inside because it's currently 10 past 12 in the morning. We get a shot of this taxi driver here. No, I'm in the wrong settings and he's moving. Ah, no. <laughs> okay, I was in the wrong settings. But maybe because of the beauty of the Sony A7 IV, I might have been able to salvage that in post. Let's hide under here while we wait for the light. The intensity of the rain, so we're going to take a little stop here before we get absolutely drenched. Now I will say, now that the borders are open here in Japan, I highly recommend that you come and visit either here in Tokyo or Osaka or any of the amazing cities here. because. I'm stoked to be here. Like we're here for a, a minimum of 14 days, just traveling around the country, just exploring. And this isn't the first POV. This isn't the last POV that I'm going to do. Um, we're just, just stoked to be here. It's incredible. I'm so happy that they've opened their borders. Dude on the moped. Get one in landscape as well. Oh, sweet. Okay. Roxanne's hiding, thinking I can't see it. 
and she's getting in the way of the locals. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to shoot around this area here for a little bit and then I think I might call it a day because it is, it's got so much heavier with the rain. Um, and this location has got a little bit more light, more stuff going on. So we'll see what we can uh, shoot around here, see what's uh, around. I think we'll start with this dude here. This dude running. And it is mega rainy. Like beyond moist. So we'll see what we can find. Person up here with their crazy settings going on here. Where's that music coming from? <laughs> you can hear lots of shouting. No idea where it's coming from, but there's obviously a lot going on. This dude walking through with the, uh, the neon lights. Right, let's, let's take a ride. Definitely loads of bars and neon lights. Oh, this is sick as well. Like straight down here. Super bright. Wow. Someone was walking across there. Wow. Someone's gonna walk across now, I think. We're gonna move down this way. Maybe there'll be some more nightlife and stuff. This dude in the uh, in the laundrette. This is where I'm going to get loads, I think. It'd be cool to have a car here. Like just a, like a typical Japanese skyline or something like that here would look incredible. Um, I have sent out a couple of messages to some people and hopefully I can do uh, a link up with somebody with a car. A typical Japanese car would be amazing to shoot. Um, but I'll obviously show you that if that happens and if it doesn't then I obviously won't show you that. Um, so there's a crossing up here. I'm thinking there's going to be a bunch more stuff. Oh, this shot's cool. Change the settings up. It's a bit darker down there. So 160 per second. F1.4. ISO 640. That's the person kneeling down on their phone. Oh. Big shout out to Roxanne for just following me around tonight. I'll link her in the description. Go and check out her work. Oh, okay, we're looking like we're gonna get some more stuff. We'll go across the road, I think. Pretty uh, quiet, because it is 1 a.m. in the morning. You heard me correct. I'm out in the pouring rain in Tokyo on my first night at 1 a.m. in the morning because I was too excited to go to sleep. <laughs> I just had to go out, I had to go to shoot. And I don't care about the rain because this is 100% worth it. <laughs> no, you did not, no. Uh, maybe this one? Oh, the lighting's really sick with that. That's nice. Oh, look at this, look at this. Wow. I'm gonna get this shot here, with these two people walking towards me. I'm gonna get low, get low. Oh. <coughs> Mega rainy, and one of these guys walking down. Ooh, gonna get one of this kind of like shop front. Let's go kind of like here, I think. Maybe if I use kind of this in the foreground to give it a bit of blur. Nice simplistic shot. If there was somebody walking out of there, obviously it would look even better. Um, oh, it's definitely just got more rainy yep. again okay so dude walking through the frame nice so I, on top of here there's like a bit of water so I was using that as a nice uh, reflection to give me a little bit of extra bokeh with the oh my god oh I'm gonna have to call it a day soon this is he gonna get in the same taxi no! Ah, shame. Ah, it's so moist outside. Don't you agree? Okay, so, so far, first impressions of Japan. It's actually incredible. Even though I'm currently soaking wet and moist, I'm going to go jump in the shower. Then we're going to have a look at the hashtag Optical Wonder where you guys can show me the content you're creating and in turn inspire me and inspire other people around the world. That was supposed to go a lot smoother. 
all showered and significantly warmer. Over the last month, I've been in the UAE and Qatar, so mega hot there and a little bit humid. Come to Japan, where it's kind of moving into winter, so it's a little bit chilly here in comparison, hence why it's so cold. We're going to have a look at the hashtag and see what you guys have been creating over the last couple of days. We're going to throw a screen record on. We're going to go to the hashtag optical wonder, like so. Tags go here. We are up to 530,000 posts. We're going to go to the most recent. I'm going to turn off the Wi Fi because uh, and go on my signal because the Wi Fi is terrible and I want them to load. So, hopefully, there we go. We're going to go to the most recent. I'm going to do a little refresh just to make sure we've got all the most recent in there. And I'm just going to grab a couple that uh, kind of stand out. We're going to go with. This one here, love the dreamy vibe. Nice little set there, that's from London. Um, this one here, nice little shot in Bar Barisal? Barisal, I have no idea where that is, which is probably quite bad of me. This one here, I like that. And this one here, love the grade on that, that's really nice. Um, doopy 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 doo. This one here, using the light to like accentuate your subject, love that. And the black and white shot, definitely might try that here in Japan. I think that would, that would work pretty good actually. I might try that. I might try something a little bit different here. And we'll do like three or four more. We'll go with uh, something like, I want to look for something that's like kind of like punchy. I like this. I like the colors in this. And we'll go with this one, that nice kind of cyberpunk vibe, which is the what I was going with in this video as well. I went for that like cyberpunky vibe. If you do want my presets, by the way, in the description and we'll do two more love the lighting in this great action shot at a gig and then we'll do uh, one last one of let's do a panic shot this one here and then also this one here as well which is also black and white now again if you want to get featured hashtag optical wonder over on instagram also head over to instagram come and say hello come and follow me over there if you don't already um, and also comment down below your instagram handle so other people can come and follow you and uh, this whole idea is about being a community and not just about me talking shit for 15 to 16 minutes it's about being an actual community where i can come and meet you and if you do live here in japan currently either in uh tokyo or osaka or uh in kyoto or even uh Nara, nara i think i'm going to as well is it nara yeah i think so uh, i'm heading there as well um, so if you live in any of those areas i might be going to other places just hit me up on instagram uh, i'm happy to meet anyone anywhere just let me know with all that being said create more stress less and uh, of course Go and enjoy.